Hey, good morning, everybody. AJ here, and um, we got a busy day today. Like I said yesterday, the football game that's normally on Friday got rescheduled to 2 p.m. today. So we're going to be testing out a whole bunch of gear in real life um, today at the game. This is going to be testing out the scoreboard OCR. Um, to pull live score over we're going to be setting up the nano station so we can beam internet into the booth but my phone is going to be there just in case as a backup um, and then we're also going to be using the PTT optics camera as well too I have everything with me just in case um, like we normally would set up just in case anything happens um, and that was in the way <laughs> um, but we're going to be testing out all this stuff and hopefully that will make everything go smooth. Um, this is a big game um, just because of the popularity of the, the schools. So um, we want to make sure we put our best foot forward and make sure we have some redundancy in place if we have any issues. And then um, also I have extra cable that I made. I'm a, I plan on putting the PTZ Optics camera on the top of the booth. So that way we can get an unobstructed line of sight. Hopefully people's heads won't be in the way while we're up there. Um, but yeah, I'm also going to go to Lowe's here in a little bit. And I'm going to probably um, get a pole or a PVC pipe or something and a base and a um, block of wood. So I can screw that in and that will be my mic stand similar to what I set up at my church so that that will be placed in the field house this beaming internet into the press box so um I got some time but at the same oh and then also right after that I finished building the PC for Mount Pleasant that was a church that I had did a long time ago maybe in 2018 they wanted to get a new system for better live streaming because um, they weren't live streaming at all we set them up just for them to have scripture and stuff like that and multiple cameras just on their TVs but they're interested in live streaming and of course my alarm will go off stop but we got them um, earlier we got us we put a system in there a Tim television studio because they were only interested in um, putting lyrics and video on TVs inside the sanctuary. Um, that's where I, uh, well, anyway, it's been a while, so that was maybe like 2018. But now they are interested in live streaming, so all we really did um, is get them a new system and we updated it with the typical type of stuff that we normally do. I finished that, so after this game, because I have to pass by the church on my way home, I'm gonna give him a call try and drop this off and set that up, help them out. Maybe it can be in place for them to use by Sunday. Um, don't know, um, but we, we got a very packed day. So let me get my stuff because I got to take multiple trips with all this stuff. I was really hoping to shrink down <laughs> the gear that I normally take with me. But um, as you can see, we got a lot of stuff that we're taking. So we got two bags one is with my laptop the other one's with the a10 and some other stuff i need to get a better bag um i don't know i'm just kind of with so much stuff inside of here i'm kind of nervous about putting the laptop in there and crunching everything i need a bigger bag um and then we also got the um nano stations and then we have the remote control for the ptz optics and the ptz optics camera i was even thinking about pulling out my suitcase and seeing if I can at least fit this stuff in there. But the good thing is I'm not that far away from, I get to park really close to the press box, so that's not gonna be an issue. So let's go ahead and um, move the car closer to the elevator so I can um, put this stuff in here and get to Lowe's and start <sighs> this busy day. So what I decided to do instead of going and buying anything at Lowe's is I had this, uh, these other tripods so and it gets pretty tall so I'm going to use that tripod in the field house to do what we need to do instead instead of buying something from Lowe's 
that will set up the nano station so I can send it the transmitting station I can send and aim at the field house um and I ended up <laughs> taking up the suitcase so it makes it easier for me to um, move everything so at this point I'm at two bags and a suitcase <laughs> to carry everything around all right so let's get this last well let's lock the computer no I already did that and we just got the computer for Mount Pleasant to take and then we are on the road all right folks we are here at the stadium and I am super super early which is a good thing um, so let me show you um, obviously what's going on here is the press box that we're gonna be in <clears throat> but the house the field house is all the way there so you can see we got those windows so the idea is to put one of the nano stations there and again I'm just estimating that's about like a little over a thousand feet distance I would think um, and then we're gonna be aiming it up there somewhere and also we're gonna be putting the PTZ maybe completely center up here and normally we're right there in the center and dangle the cables down um, and go into that window right there so we can control that now I know I was jokingly talking about it what I'd like to do if we have a recurring contract with them is to put a mount right there and during the season we just reach out hook the camera up to that and then when the season's over take it down because I mean the mount is $50 that would allow it to just go right there um, it's it's supposed to get up to 56 right now um, it's a little cold um, but that would at least allow stuff to go a little bit smoother here oh and the press box is open oh awesome let me let me start bringing my stuff in I I'm I'm, I'm happy I can set up faster than I thought all right so just as you can see I'm here in the press box and it is 44 degrees in here. So yes, I turned the heat on. Woo! <laughs> um, so coming over this way, this is leading up. This is where we're gonna go and put the PTZ and then dangle these cables down here so we can get a connection to everything. Um, I got one more trip I need to do. Um, and like I said, this wind is in here and found out the game was postponed because we had a whole lot of rain and the field was so wet. It was considered a hazard for any of the, um, athletes to be on the field. That's the reason why it was postponed. Um, but it's supposed to get up to like 56 here. Um, I'm going to keep as much stuff closed as possible to warm this place up and we're going to walk through setting up everything. All right, so we got our cables dangled down here, and I have <laughs> more than enough cable. Um, and now that I think about it, I was the only one here. I left my mask in the car, so I got to make sure I go get that. But let's go ahead, and um, I ended up getting another super clamp, and I have a longer cable, but what I'm going to do is clamp this on to the stand and plug this directly into the PTZ Optics, and now with hindsight after what I found out at Greater Works, I need to make sure I connect this to the network so that I can make an adjustment for um, to turn on the audio to even go through the camera. So let me do that now, which will require me to pull this other cable here for that. All right, so I just finished setting up the box over there and now we just gotta see if we can line it up. I, I would hope this isn't that far out of the way um it showed up on this side got on the wi-fi for a second it showed up now get on this other side try and line it up and see what we can do all right so we got it set up had to change out the cable and i have a good connection already so we're going to be set for the game today to hear johnson steps back and he's, he's got Wide open on the other side, he had Curtis Allen. But what a catch. beautiful catch! All the way down to the two yard line. That was Willie Jennings reeling that in. Beautiful effort. 
Wow. Fully contested all the way down. That corner was all over top of him, and he just had the smallest little window. And to hear Johnson put it right there where it put needed it to be. Right. Alrighty, the game is over. This performed like a champ. I was getting 80 down and 80 up. Solid, rock solid internet performance. Um, now we're heading to Mount Pleasant. All right, we are finally home. Whew. So um, ended up dropping off the system with Maxwell at um, Mount Pleasant, but they had a church meeting. So I have to set up another time to catch up with them to actually configure it. They got a new sound system that everything is on the old system that we upgraded maybe two and a half years ago. Um, really wasn't the upgrade that they wanted. Um, but that was what was in the budget that they could do. Um, but we're going to move over their data over to the other system on another day. Maybe next Saturday, um, even though the next game is Saturday. Don't know if we're going to be able to go to that one or not um, since it's not a home game. But the Nano Station performed great. Uh, I think that's going to be the go-to method from now on and then once get a hands on Starlink see how that goes but the other thing I figured out um, I have to maybe give the PTZ camera another chance what it really was is it was the white balance and the coloring and everything that I needed to tweak which normally I just leave it on automatic but it was so bright outside I don't know um, I just didn't read through the manual on how to do the push button white balance and all that other stuff because honestly I've never really had to do that because I've always been inside and then my camcorder just works outside so I need to do some more study on that but the setup works great uh, I am looking at playing with some other software but anyway um, good day good situation good setup got me some food behind me um, I'm gonna work on a little couple of things and then I gotta go play at New Hope tomorrow so I won't be at my home church. Get some rest time in. Maybe I'll see if I can watch the Snyder Cut or something like that. Um, see if I can sign up for HBO Max just for a day or something. <laughs> but um, anyway, folks, thanks for watching. We will um, catch up with y'all in the next video. Later.